Colorado lawmakers are trying to make sure you're not getting bamboozled by fees when buying concert or event tickets. They're making sure you know what you're paying up front, even though the fees themselves are not going anywhere. Yeah, we know this has been a big mess at times. Nine News reporter Lauren Scafidi joins us live in studio now. Lauren, the new bill would make the first price you see the price you actually pay. Yes, because you know how it goes. $50 for your ticket, then 30 bucks in surprise fees when you check out. Actually costing you $80, but if this bill passes, you would just see that 80 up front and at checkout. It could be a reality soon with the bill now heading to the state house floor next week. The bill accounts for sporting events and live music events. It's a big deal because listen to this. The U.S. Government Accountability Office found additional fees made up almost a third of the ticket's price. No surprise, right? The bill also would mean that you get a refund when events are canceled, no questions asked. And it would crack down on deceptive websites pretending to be official ticket sites or venues. I mean, we have Red Rocks. We have incredible venues um, and incredible teams. And we, we are a music state. <laughs> and it should be easy for consumers here to go see shows. If it passes the state house, it will move on to the Senate, then the governor's desk. Lawmakers are hoping to wrap this up in the next few weeks here before all those summer events kick off. Live in the studio, Lawrence Cafiti, 9 News. We were talking about this a little bit earlier. We remember with Taylor Swift and that whole fiasco. And, you know, I think it will be nice to just know up front, okay, I got a budget for this much, yeah. not so many fees on the back end, right? And that whole Taylor Swift drama is actually what got the ball rolling for all of this. They said the system is broken. Let's do something about it. Yeah, I can imagine. A couple of steps to go, but we'll see how that pans out at the Capitol. Yeah. Thanks so much, Lauren.